Hey everyone, it's Candace here at Hardens and Hard Hats, and today I'm going to show you what we've got done on the new build this week. Now, full disclaimer, I actually lost the SD card that had all of my footage from day one and day two. I do have day three though, so that is at least some good news. I will take you around the whole thing though, so because basically what you're seeing is a finished product. But I'll show you what they did on day one and day two, and then I'll end the video with day three. So let's go ahead and get started. So day one was all the exterior walls of the house. I haven't done a walkthrough on the sides, so let's start with that. They basically did all the exteriors and then all the windows so that you could actually see all the rooms. So you see there's a window there. That's going to be, it should be a much smaller window in the master bathroom. Walking around to the back of the house. Okay, we're at the back of the house. You see these three big windows here are for the master. They actually, day one, they did not have the window sills in there, so it's kind of cool. You can see you have these three windows here. That is the living room. Here's the back door here. Then walking around the perimeter here, there's three big windows for the dining room slash breakfast nook. This is the kitchen though. Just doesn't have any windows in it. You have this one window here for that bedroom. And then here's the front of the house. So this will be two windows in this front bedroom here. This window over here, that's going to be the laundry slash utility room. And then we're here at the front door. So that's basically what they got done on day one. So this is where we act like it is day two of the framing project and show you all the interior walls because that's what they got done on day two. So let's go inside. Okay, like I said, we're at the front door and today they got all the interior walls done. So this is the big foyer. And then now you can see all the insides of the rooms that we saw from the outside bedroom, linen closet, bathroom closet, and then there's this little hallway down here. I'll turn and then that's the second guest bedroom and it has its own closet there. Now we're going to swing around here. Here's the powder bath. They did put a door on here. They did not have a door at first. They forgot to frame for it. This is the laundry room here. I'm going to swing around here behind us to look at this mud bench. I am so excited about that. That was not originally there. They added that for us, so that's really cool. Okay, we're gonna walk back through to the foyer. We're gonna make our way through the rest of the foyer. And then this is where it gets real exciting. This is the kitchen. You can see the pantry here. And there, once again, is the breakfast nook with the three windows. All right, we turn this way. Here is the living room. There's the fireplace. It's still kind of hard to tell because there's lots of wood everywhere, but here's the fireplace here in the corner. You can see how it's angled and goes up there. All right, going to turn to the right, go to the study. The study is looking a lot bigger. There's a storage closet back there, but it's looking really nice. Okay, then we're going to go through this little hallway here, which is the master. All right. We saw all those exterior walls earlier. So here we go. The door frame, there's a little section here, section here, maybe chair, maybe lamp, we'll see. And then here is the master bathroom. All of this, this will be a vanity here. You walk over here, there's the toilet closet, and then here's the master closet. It's pretty big. It's gonna be fantastic, love it, love it. Okay, we're going to head back into the living room. We're going to walk right through these walls here, through the study. And the other thing that they did on day two was actually the ceiling. So not the roof, but the ceiling. So everywhere in the house is going to be 10 foot ceilings all the way around, even the kitchen here, except for the living room. And it's going to be cathedral ceiling. Look at that. This is just going to make it look so much more grand and beautiful. So that's actually what they did on day one, day two, and now we're on to day three. Okay, we're actually at the back of the house and John is gonna show us what they did today. So they got all the rafters installed on the roof. They got some bracing and supports in there because some of these rafters are pretty long. They go all the way up. This whole back porch actually, they got done. You can see here the cedar columns, the cedar beam across the top there. They got all that stuff installed. They got the roof on the back porch. So that'll be a nice big gable where it'll be open in the middle. And we're thinking about putting like a table there or something that'd be, be nice. 
Looks like they have a little bit of work left to do, um, just kind of cleaning up, finishing a few blocking and hangers and stuff like that. But for the most part, it looks like the patio's finished. Did they do anything on the front porch today? Or? They got the roof on the front porch. Okay, also. let's walk to the front. I do see that they made some arches out of this. Yep. Right here. There's some like plywood and then kinda you can see like hallway. arches in the hallway areas. Mm -hmm. So those will look nice. Alright, okay, let's continue to the front. So right up here on the front porch, they got cedar installed. And you can see these cedar beams, they go all the way up there, kind of notched out for the beam there um, on the 2x12s oh. going out there. So they got all that cedar done and then put the front porch on and then got the whole roof installed there. And if we go out further, they have the window in there. Uh, um, you can see they oh, that little window right there? Yep, the little <gasps> window there. They're missing a window there. They got to frame that in. Yep. This is so cool. And then you can kind of see, I'll go to the street and so you can see like the front. Wow, that is a nice looking house. Well, this looks amazing. What's left to do? It looks like they're almost done. What's left to do? Just go in and do like a little bit more blocking and stuff. Like the water heater. They need to frame in a window on that gable. Uh, so just some stuff that's probably not going to be super visible to yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. No, nothing nothing big and major that you can okay. really see. So then we're kind of done? Pretty much done framing. I mean, we're ready to do to do cornice and stuff work for sure. <gasps> um, if we can get what? him out here before it starts raining too much. No way. Um, we'll okay. All right. So that looks like it might be it for framing this week. So we will see you next time. And as always, happy housing from the Hardens. And then this is the part of the video where I lie and act like this new slab right next door to us is our slab because I lost the footage to that too.